in in my novel, Divine Rights, I talk about how our nation is essentially infiltrated by foreigners and essentially become a political party to take care of the people. Um, even Socrates himself, the philosopher, didn't like democracy. You know, the irony. But, you know, I'll use the, the example of going out to sea. If you're going out to sea, who do you want to, you know, steer you ahead? Is it people who have no knowledge of the sea? Or is it educated, seafaring people who understand the, the whole notion of what it is to sail from one island to, to a, a, another country? When our political system brings us to the notion of thinking that voting is a is a birthright. We're fooling ourselves, right? Because history has shown where there's been societies where you go and you tell the people what is needed for them, but they don't want to hear that, right? They'd rather the sweet stories and the lies and the promises, and they put their faith in that. And that multiplied with poverty, need, colonialism, it puts us in a place where it is now seen that politicians are essentially the pawns of the people who have power in this country. A lot of times, it's, it, things are, are people fear saying the truth, but the truth is the truth. And that's, the, that's been the history of our country for, since day one. Well, let me hear you say, Mountain, Mountain, Mountain.